This is going to be one of my favorite salads right here. And all I want to do is I'm going to combine a lot of different tastes here for you. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some of these greens. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to rip them up. You want some salad, Jake? Sure. All right, Jake's going to have some. I'll make it a little bit bigger. The next thing I want to do is I'm just going to sprinkle some pumpkin seeds in there. I'll use walnuts. Sometimes I'll use almonds. Matter of fact, I'll have, I'll have some almonds here too. I'll put a couple slices of them in there too. So with the uh, cranberries, really just dice these up so that they mix throughout the salad. And scap these babies up and sprinkle that around. You like the uh, cranberry shake? I love the cranberries, man. Uh, like you said, it's nice when you chop them up because if you don't, man, you gotta chew on them jokers a little bit. This goat cheese, you can pretty much catch at any store too, and they've got it crumbled for you. It makes for another, another type of taste coming into your mouth. I uh, already got some diced up onions here, so let's just dice them up a little bit more. I love red onions, but sometimes they can overpower. I'm just gonna sprinkle this over. It's all about vegetables, getting the enzymes you want in your body, the vitamins, you're full of destructive things you do to your body, those of you who eat that fast fake food. So I'm gonna dice up some uh, cucumbers in there. Oh, you don't like cucumbers, do you? Mushrooms? Yes, sir. Sprinkle some of that. Like, I'll put those cucumbers all on mine when I try to pull Jake's out. Last but not least, the avocado. Well, how do you cut an avocado? You just slice right into it, not too deep, and you do the old checkerboard thing, and then you take a spoon, ladle it right out there. Watch out for the, uh, the seed, you don't want to have that in there. That'll crack your teeth. Done that before. <laughs> Lastly, I'm gonna bring uh, out one of my favorite balsamics here, and this is a balsamic cranberry and pear. And what I'm gonna do is do like a three to one on this, and then put three, which will be your oil. Because if you look at it right now, can you see in there? It's like the oil and water thing. The way around that is you get in there and you stir it right up. And it will last like that for just enough time to pour it over your salad. Put a little bit of uh, these chia seeds that you'll see. I might have put them, uh, you might have seen me put them in shakes before. They can go in just about anything. They have great for the uh, omega 3s and omega 6 and omega 9. Put a little salt on there. And then just uh, regular black pepper here. And there we are. And let me shake and get you on the plate. Oh, that's going to be nice. Awesome salad, man. Tastes amazing, man. Next time, we'll see you on uh, Slicing and Dicing with DDP. One and only Jake Snake Roberts. See ya. Lovely.